All right, guys, in this video, I have a very powerful phrase that's going to reprogram your subconscious mind that's going to create great things to come to you in your life. But the first step is desire. So that's the mainspring of action. So I want you to locate something you want to be, do or have in your life right now or an issue that you want solved because thoughts create. OK, so you have words and words create thoughts. OK, thoughts create images in your mind, whether consciously or unconsciously. And then those images create the feeling state. That feeling state is then impressed into the subconscious mind and then creates your external reality, all right? This is how this works. So it's words, thoughts, images, feelings impressed into the subconscious mind. So I have a very powerful technique for you. So I want you to find something that you wanna do, be, or have right now, or before you do this technique, I want you to find something you want resolved in your life or something that you want in your life. And then I want you to become physically immobilized. So either lay down or become like in a meditative state wherever you are before you do this meditation. Become, become very still and calm and very receptive. And I want you to, re I want you to repeat this phrase right here i want you to say isn't it wonderful now that it is finished isn't it wonderful now that this is finished isn't it wonderful now that this is finished say this and it will create the end result so what this word is doing to you this phrase is then creating a thought of it being finished okay so and then that thought of being finished that, that it isn't it wonderful now that this is finished, it's creating an image in your mind. So whatever issue that you have going on in your life that you want solved or there's something that you want to have, that image is gonna pop up in your mind, okay? So, but it must be persisted in. That image creates a feeling, then that feeling is impressed into the subconscious mind, but we must be persistent at this. However, persistence is not even necessary if you are physically immobilized, if you are in the state akin to sleep that Neville Goddard talks about, because once you're in that state of akin to sleep, then you are highly impressionable into the subconscious mind. So whatever feeling state that you are in and you, imp that's like the, that's like the moment of intercept. That's like the moment of inception, you know, where you have created this feeling right before you went into the drift. And it's like a, it's like a dominant feeling. So you're not having to persist it all throughout the day. That's why I say become physically immobilized in a meditative state or a drowsy state or this state akin to sleep before you say this phrase. It's very, very powerful because those words, this phrase that you're saying, isn't it wonderful now that this is finished? Isn't it wonderful now that this is finished? You're saying those words and those words are creating those thoughts. Then those thoughts are creating an image in your mind of it being finished. So you're seeing that at image in your mind automatically. Okay. Automatically. Then that image is creating this feeling state, the feeling state of it being finished. Then that feeling state of it being finished is now being impressed into the subconscious mind in this drowsy state. So the subconscious mind has no choice but to receive that phrase. So that's why it's very powerful. You can do this throughout the day if you want to, but it's the most powerful when you're physically immobilized because then you're in that state of, of reception. You're in that state of inception into the subconscious realm where it has no choice but to give you the feelings that you have as you're passing into the drift in between the conscious and the subconscious. So that's why this is very powerful, but this is what it is, guys. Okay, so come up with your desired results. So desire is the mainspring of action. So you come up with your desire, whatever you wanna do, be, or have, or the issue that you want solved in your life, whether you're helping somebody creating a relationship, wealth, health, doesn't matter what it is. Find that desire and then repeat the phrase, isn't it wonderful now that this is finished? Isn't it wonderful now that this is finished? Do this in the immobilized state or the meditative state. That way you are in highly impressionable into the subconscious realm because remember, this phrase creates a thought. That thought creates an image in your mind unconsciously, okay, so it's automatically gonna do this. And then that image in your mind of this thing being done is gonna create the feeling. That feeling state is the key. That is the secret to creation, is that feeling state as you drift into the subconscious realm. That feeling state then, in the immobilized state, will then be impressed and it will cause inception into the subconscious realm and be affected into your life and that issue 
will be resolved. That issue will now be finished. And isn't it wonderful now that this issue is finished or this thing is finished? I love you guys very much, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Don't forget to give me one thing you guys are grateful for. All I'm offering is the truth, nothing more.